What is going on guys, Tizwafa here, and welcome back to some more Slime Rancher. Now last time we left off, we had a little bit of fun again. We were playing basketball with the with the slimes, the, what was it called, slime ball or something stupid. <laughs> and uh, you guys said, hey, why, why don't you try and get 21 points? And I, I was able to exceed that. I was able to get, what, 28 or something like that? And then the second time around, I was able to get like 25 or 26 or something like that. So that was, that was pretty good. Some of you guys were like, hey, if you, if you want to really get a high score what you need to do is try and hit like the backboard otherwise the game will uh like, like detect oh he's cheating or whatever so i guess i wanted to do that oh can i stand on the rim oh my gosh Ooh. should i try this out i kind of want to try this out let's grab a bunch of pink slimes <laughs> yeah if i grab enough pink slimes over here you guys will see they'll start spawning out of these little uh little little tubes over here which is yeah oh wait well yeah, they spawn out the twos, but they were phosphor ones instead of the pink ones. Uh, I guess it makes sense because it's turning nighttime right now, right? So, yep, there you go. I guess you could use both of these guys and just kind of use them as a little bit of an example. As, uh, just to kind of see. Can, can I exceed my score from earlier, from last episode? Can I get... I'd say 30. If we can get 30 by just standing on the rim and then just shooting him into there, you know, making sure we actually do hit the backboard so it counts, you know? Because that's what you guys said, hey, it, it, it doesn't count if you don't hit the backboard, it prevents cheating or whatever. <laughs> I don't know how that prevents cheating when we can still cheat just by standing on it, right? You think it'd be like, oh, someone's standing on the backboard, we better, we better just disqualify all the points going forward, but no. <laughs> okay, th this should be enough, right? We have like almost 50, oh, jeez, oh, that's like Gordo right there, what in the world? I guess, I guess perception or uh, whatever you'd call it right there. What's it called? Depth perception. <laughs> kind of looked like I thought he was a lot further away and I thought he was a smaller little slime. Yeah, look at these guys spawning. In. Okay. You know what? Let's start the game. Uh, you know what? Let's not do it yet. Let's, let's stand on it and then we'll start it. Let's see. Yeah, see, look at this. I can stand here. This is crazy. Oh! Oh! Oh no! No! I fell! Oh! No! It's slipping me off! Oh! Okay, there you go. Oh, it's not. It's not about. There you go. I need to angle this chip. Wait, it's not. Oh! Oh! Five, six, seven. I need to get these guys back. <laughs> need to get my score back up. Hold on. We only have a whole minute to get 30 points here. I don't know if I'll be able to scam this. Whoop. There we go. Eight, nine. Oh, come on. Ten. Up. Oh. How did you guys get like 200? Were you guys lying or something? 30 seconds left. How? There we go. Hitting the back. Boy, you guys seem to be right, though, in the aspect. Oh, that one should have counted right there. He flew back into there afterwards. <laughs> oh my gosh, 19 seconds left. Okay, I'm, I'm going to start using Phosphor Slimes here in a sec. Wrap these guys back. Boom. 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 21. Oh, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Oh, I think we're going to do it. I think we... Oh, we hit 30. There's a new score there. Can I hit like... Can I hit 40? Can I hit 40 before the end? No, they're in the way! No! Oh, 38. Okay. <laughs> we still exceeded our last score by over 10. Well... I think, I think exactly 10, actually, now I think about it. Wasn't it 28 last time? So, yeah, we got a lot better this time around, but, yeah. I guess if you strategically just angle it just right to where you could hit the backboard and it bounces in, then, yeah, you, you, you could definitely scam that into getting, like, 200 points or something like that, I'm sure. But, yeah, I wasn't able to do that, unfortunately, so that sucks. Uh, you guys eat the poker fruit, sure, why not? Pink plorts, I guess we'll set up over here. Here we go. Anyways, I guess we'll go do a, uh, a mission or something like that real quick. You know what? One one thing I want to do is, uh, I don't know how many more of these can I do. Can I do it with, oh, I can do it with Bob one. Okay, let's do another Bob one. Chicken. <laughs> we need to get his chickens right now. He's got two roosters and one painted handy ones. Oh, he gives us a, uh, a royal jelly. Ooh. Oh, you know what? Uh, I got a comment last episode reminding me, hey, you completely forgot to make the chicken cloner. I think... We should still have the resources to make it. Was it? Was it? I, I think it was like a royal jelly and like. I think it required those little cube things, which by the way, you guys left comments last episode. <laughs> a few of you guys left comments saying I forgot about the manifold cubes over here. And I, I went back and grabbed them. And uh, as you can see, I did one more uh, little go into there to get uh, about 150, I think exactly 150 more of these uh, glitch reports right here, bug reports. So just one more over here, and I think we've got it. We only need to get 122 more, and then boom, we're good. We can have access to his uh, Victor's lab there. But. What was I doing over here? Oh, you know what? Off camera, I did get a, uh, a fashion. Yeah, clip on fashion pod. So I guess we can get a bow tie or something like that. So that's crazy. $9,000. Sure, why not? Can I, make, can I make that? I don't know if I can. Let's see. Decorations. Is that de Oh, is it curio? Oh, it is curios. Okay. Uh, we can make it two royal jelly. Jeez. Well, we have nine. So pff, why not? Puddle pours. I need more of those if I want those. But I just we just need one and then we can place it down and get like infinite clip on fashion pod bow ties. So either way, whoa, whoa, what was it? Uh, oh, yeah. Chicken cloner. 
Oh yeah, we can do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was the manifold cubes. And probably some other stuff, but we can definitely make it now. Boom. There we go. Okay. Let, let, let's see how this works. Especially now that Bob said... Oh, you know what? We can actually, uh, a little bit of a shortcut here. Go this way. There we go. But Bob wants, what, two Roosters, one, uh, painted hen. Let's see, let, let's, let's see how this click, uh, chicken cloner thing works. Let's see where we can place that. Now, here we go. This is a perfect spot for it. What's it called? Oh, here we go. It is a utility. Double your chickens half the time. Okay, boom. So let's see, how does this work? Oh, here's, well, you, you know what? Let's just use regular hen hens, I guess, to test it out real quick, I suppose, because there's so many of them here. And I don't know if I have enough, uh, oh yeah, yeah, look at all these over here, nice. So we've got five hen hens right now. Doubles your chickens half the time. So you, there's a 50% chance of getting a chicken, or two chickens here? Oh, that worked? Oh, it did! Oh! Oh, wow, a lot of luck right there. We got two, oh, nice! So we started out with what? What did we have just a second ago? Eight? Now we're up to ten? Yeah, look at that, we got another one right there. 10 up to 11. Oh no! <laughs> well that chicken just got annihilated right there. So yeah, we had some bad luck there. And yeah, this guy looks like a chicken here with the little, 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 little eyes and the beak and the thing on the top of its head. <laughs> oh man, another one got annihilated, man! Oh, there you go, we got two right there, cool. So I wonder, if I put 10 in here, am I gonna have more than 10 uh, like coming out there like is it going to even out and I'll have just exactly 10 or I'll have more or I'll have less I, I, I'm genuinely curious here. Let's see We put 10 in how many are back here? Oh, that doesn't look like 10. Oh Man, yeah, we lost two right there man. That sucks. Can we get more? Can I get back up to 10? Uh, looks like maybe no, oh, that's the same. That's the same. I guess as many uh, of them doubled as got killed there or something like that. Oh, oh, that was bad. <laughs> we went from 10 to 8 to 4. Oh, that, oh, that was good. What are we up to 8 again? Oh, yeah, we're back up to 8. Whew. I guess if you do this enough times, maybe eventually you're going to come out. Oh, that looks like 10. Yep, 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 10. Cool. Yeah, eventually you'll come out on top or even out or whatever else, you know? Oh my gosh, but we're literally- Oh, we're up to 12! Okay, cool. <laughs> Alright, you know what? If we have a lot of, uh, do we have a lot of chickens just over here? Oh, we do, 13. Should I, should I gamble these chickens? <laughs> We've got like a, like a, basically a gambling command on our Discord server, and there's people literally addicted to gambling, and I'm about to do that in the game right now with heckin' hen hens. <laughs> so we have 31 hen hens, throwing them inside the chicken cloner. Are we gonna have- Oh my gosh, there's so many hen hens back there. Is this more or less than 31? I, I, I'm like just just taking a look at this. I can't tell. Oh, wow. I wasn't even looking at the hot bar during that. We're up to 40. Oh, that's really good. But if I do it again, <laughs> are we going to be at like 26 or something like that? Let's see. So 40. Uh, I, I see. Once again, there's just so many chickens back there. It's hard to like guesstimate. How many chickens are in that big ball of chickens back there, you know? <laughs> oh, jeez, it went from four. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, we had 40 down to 32, so, uh, yikes. We went down a little bit right there. What do we have earlier, like 36 or something like that? Up to 40, so, I don't know, I guess it just went pendulum, uh, swung the other direction right there. Uh-oh, I think I think we have significantly less. This doesn't look as much as what we just had. What do we have just a minute ago? Uh-oh. Yeah, we're down about four. Yeah, we had like, what, 36 just a second ago? Ooh, down to 32. Okay, I don't know if gambling with chickens is, is necessarily a good idea here, but there we go. You know what, maybe, maybe it's something you could do is if you don't, if you have like one rooster and you're like, uh, oh, I need another, okay, we have 30. I'm just going to put 15 in each thing, jeez. <laughs> just so these guys can still eat. But if you have one rooster, you could be like, oh, I could go out and try and find another rooster or I could put them in the chicken cloner and possibly get a second rooster out of them. Oh, what in the world? There's already 15 there. What? Oh, the, the drone must have delivered them or something like that, I guess. There you go. Uh, either way. Uh, but yeah, you'll still have that chance of losing that original rooster if that happens too, so <laughs> you're literally gambling with that kind of stuff. But speaking of such, hold on. Let's, yeah, let's just grab like every chicken here. Do we have four different types over here? Not counting like uh, chicks? Uh, man, I keep picking up chicks. Here we go. <laughs> I'm just so good here, you guys. I'm I'm so good at picking up chicks. <laughs> oh, there you go. So we got a bunch of roostros and, and stony hens and briar hens and whatever else. Can I do? I want to gamble all these. I don't know. 
What was it, one Roostro or two Roostro? I don't know. Let's let's put... Oh! Well, I guess we lost one right there. Whoops. I don't know if I want to gamble anymore. Because <laughs> we need to use these for Bob, I think, right? I, it might have just been one Roostro and then two painted. I don't know how many we had right there. Oh, I think we went up. I think we had six. And now we're up to eight. Let's see. Oh, whoops. Oh, I think I suctioned him. Ooh, can I suction him through this? And it, like, counts again. Oh! Wait, what? Wait, what? Uh, did that? <laughs> did that kill those? Or what happened right there? I can't tell if they got annihilated in there or did they get suctioned back into the backpack. I have no idea. <laughs> okay, you know what? While we still have all the chickens, let's go over to Bob. Let's, let's go give him the roostros, the painted hens that he wants. And then he'll give us whatever. Oh, and you know what? You guys come to saying, uh, I need to... Oh, eight minutes left. Ooh. Okay, yeah, it was two roostros. Oh, whoops. It was two roost, roost, roost rows. So boom, there you go. Oh, hey, there's my roll jelly. I'll take that. Boom. Oh, whoops. Now we don't have any roost rows. Man, I literally just said earlier <laughs> about the roost row like analogy or whatever example thing. And now I actually don't have any roost rows. <laughs> Man, I, I don't know where we could find some roost row. I, I guess if we're. Oh, wow. That that chick chickadoo just grew up into a uh, stony hen right there. That's cool. But yeah, we genuinely have no roost rows now. So uh, that kind of sucks. <laughs> Oh man, we have elder stuff over here. Elder hen? Elder Roostro? Cool. Uh, I guess we can put him over here. Sure. Go to the hunter guys. Too bad the, uh, the elder Roostro, I, I don't think, gives double plorts from these guys, right? I think those are both uh, elder Roostros. Hold on. Yep. Hold on. This guy's really hungry. Oh, oh. I think, didn't we myth, myth bust this before? Yeah, see, that one just gave us a single plort right there. So yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't help us out any more than uh, usual, but whatever. I guess we'll ch keep the chicken cloner over here. And if we, uh, I'm like, this just makes sense. There's there's the chicken coop over here. There are the chickens that spawn naturally all over the place. It just makes sense. So I guess if I have extra chickens or not enough chickens or something like that, I guess uh, we can put them through a chicken cloner and pray, play our luck. And, and also pray that we actually get double the chickens and not lose the chicken that we threw in there, right? Speaking of such, I want to see if we can find like one roostro. Maybe throw them inside of the chicken clone or see if we can get a second one back. I don't know if that's something we'll be able to do here. I don't know where we can find them necessarily, honestly. Like, I know they, they should spawn where the chicken nests and stuff are, but it seems like they... Oh, oh there we go. Boom. Roostro. Okay. One roostro. It's like a stony chickadoo right there. Let's go throw it inside the, uh, the, the chicken cloner. Hopefully we get another rooster out of this, and if not, then I guess we're going to lose a rooster, so that'll suck. <laughs> All right, here, here it is. Oh, oh, it worked! Hey, we had some pretty good luck right there. See, the chicken cloner came in very handy right there. I thought that was like a random rooster or something like that. But why is there a random uh, briar hand just stuck right there? How'd that happen? Yep, there you go. All right, well... That, that was pretty fun, just messing around with a chicken cloner right there. Kind of kind of glad that we finally did that instead of putting it off and actually forgetting about it and stuff like that over time, right? So that's good. Let's grab more of the lemons and stuff up here. And let's grab the mint mangoes. Oh, whoops. <laughs> because I did your job for you there. Let's grab 24 mint mangoes because I got some comments of you guys saying, hey, uh, you guys remember last episode, actually. Uh, I think it was at the end of the episode. So if you guys didn't watch the entire video, you might be wondering why we have a heckin' giant honey gordo there or something like that, right? I think, wasn't that... I don't know, was this last? I don't know. I don't remember if it was last episode. It might have been the one before. I don't know. <laughs> Either way, let's give him 24. I think we had 27 just a minute ago, so let's wait until we have four. No, three left over. Just making sure. So when we have three left over, he he will have one more mint mango before he explodes. I just want him to be as big as here he is. Here he is. He's huge. I can give him one more. Oh! And now if I get, oh, and he's like jiggling and everything too. <laughs> like if we give him one more man mango, he's going to burst into a bunch of little honey slimes there. <laughs> and yeah, look, look at his crown. It's so huge too. Look, oh yeah, speaking of the decorations and the, uh, the, what's it called? Cheerios or whatever it's called. Uh, we, we need to make the, uh, or, or place down the little bow tie thing. I want to at least see what that looks like on some slimes. Especially because, uh, here it is. Clip on fashion pond, clip on tie. There you go. I don't know how many we want to get. Uh, maybe like 30, 40. No, nah, you know what? Let's get 50. <laughs> and, oh, oh, oh. I'm, we, we, could, we, we could put that on, on drones and stuff like that too, I bet. Hold on. Which drone? Uh. See, I, I love the. <laughs> that guy's jiggling nonstop. What does it look like on a drone? I like that. I honestly like it. Like, he looks like a servant with the little uh, little bow tie there. I'm like, he basically is. He's a drone. He, he's doing all these jobs for us. He's a servant. But I wish we could have the googly eyes on top of the bow tie there. That would look so wacky and funny. <laughs> but I, I honestly like it. I, I think that's great. Uh, oh, yeah. Another thing you guys said. 
uh, that you guys suggested actually was to try and put the uh, the fashion pots on something else. I forget what it was. I wish I could remember what it was though. Ah man, because it would have been. I, I really wanted to test it out because we have the fashion pots right now, you know. But I guess we can give some of these uh to these guys over here that we haven't given anything to. Uh, so yep, there you go. Can I even see the bow tie on these guys? Oh, here we go. Oh, it's like black on those guys. What? It's like a different color depending on which slime it's on? I can't tell. Yeah, look at that. It's like, either that is just because it's dark or something like that over here. Oh my gosh, look at all the plorts. Why is this not suctioning up the plorts? Oh, it must have been full and this guy's only just now emptying it or something like that. Yo, why is it like black there? I can't see it. It must be because it's dark. Hold on. Is it nighttime outside right now? Can we tell? Yeah, it's daytime. Okay, let's go over here. Let's see. Can we, can we give some random slime a bow tie and it's like red or is it like a different color or what, what's, what's happening here oh yeah it is red there can't really oh he's so cute look at that oh what about on the blue one you see it a little bit easier on the blue one i'm sure right oh jeez, well he just turned into a gordo or, or a largo right there jeez man i just want to oh my god it was chickens you guys said to put on chickens and it works oh no the chicken just got eaten right there <laughs> Oh my gosh, put on the chicken. Look at the chicken with the bow tie. Oh, oh, oh. Look at the chicken with the bow tie. <laughs> I think we already tested it on the chickens, didn't we? It must have been something else then. But I guess I'm glad that I'm testing it on the chicken. <laughs> I love how it like bounces back when we hit it with the neck and <laughs> the bow tie is so hard. And it, it falls back a little bit there. That's funny. Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure we put googly eyes on chickens. So it must not have been that. It must have been something else. I don't know what it was. I'd have to go back and because I don't think I put that in my notes. I put like four or five things in my notes for this episode and it was not that was not one of them, unfortunately. So that sucks. But either way, we have a royal jelly right now. I suppose we can go put that up inside of the uh wait on these. Yep, these things are ready. So uh yep. guess we'll grab all this stuff and we'll get the uh the refinery link. We'll place that down over here. And then what I also want to do for this episode, I, I don't even did I even mention it yet? I don't think so. <laughs> I want to go to the glass desert, to the back of the glass desert, and try and find out what happens in that ending part there. Because you guys said, hey. If you go to that ending there, it's not like a point of no return. Like, you can actually do the ending of whatever the puzzle is over there. And then you can continue playing. Oh, that's strange. Oh, I don't have room for that. Ooh. Uh, but I can continue playing after we do whatever the end is over there. So that's going to be really cool. I, I was very hesitant about it. Because I was like, oh, man, I don't know if I want to do that ending over there. Or else, you know, that might be the end of the series. I can't come back and, and continue doing some stuff. But I, it sounds like you guys said, hey. You can just do it, and then you can continue on playing the game, so that's cool. I guess we can go check that out later on this episode. And while we're in the glass desert, another thing you guys said was, hey, while you're there, you might as well try and activate all the, uh, all the fountains. You guys remember the fountains where if you put, like, a specific plort on, like, three statues, like the, the, the fountains that have, what's it called? Some sort of water. Some sort of, like, blessed water or something like that. And you could, you could spray that on some plants and it, like, makes it an oasis bubble around. So, I, I think there's just one, maybe two more of those things. And I think... I think the only plorts we're missing are from these guys, the tangle ones, so... Oh, man, of course there are no tangle ones in there, man! Well, there's a couple in there that look like they can eat, so... Grab some of these, hopefully get some double plorts out of them. I don't know how many we'd need... Well, only three, right? There you go. Yep, okay, so we're going to get some plorts out of him. That one's going to get us some plorts perfect. Awesome, more plorts right there. Cool. Hopefully these guys are doing pretty well. I'm like, they got plenty of uh, phase lemons there, so shouldn't have to worry about them. Here we go, here we go. Perfect. All right, so we've got six tango plorts. Oh, man, here's a couple more that I could eat. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh, whoops. Man. There you go. I just keep throwing the prickle pears inside there. There you go. So let's go to the glass desert real quick. I think it's relatively close by. Like, uh, oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, the moth blanket, or, uh... Yeah, Moss Blanket there. I, I guess we can check that out a little bit later, see if we have more Royal Jelly, but we already have a lot, so I don't think we have to worry about that, at least for right now. Where was I going to go with these? Oh, yeah, this way. Yeah, towards the front. I think we pretty much activated every oasis over here in this part of the map, except for, you know, the one over here. They have to activate... That was in front of... Oh, man, more Roostros. I, I should grab those and put them inside the Chicken Cloner and play my luck. <laughs> see how good we're... Uh... Oh, was it these things? I don't think it was. Or the ones that had, like, the face? I don't think it was the cactus you guys wanted me to test out. Where's the one that had the face on it? I don't know, but, um, it, it is, like, a decoration thing. I guess I could make it at home. Oh, 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 I could hear the, th I, oh, we got the Gilded Ginger, you guys. I just ran right into it right there. I heard the jingling. I saw it in the background. Boom. Gilded Ginger, we can get another giant gold Gordo back at home, you guys. 
But unfortunately, we have to wait until we have three gilded ginger and then feed him, and then we get a bunch of gold uh, slime guys. Is this the one with the face? I don't think it was. I don't, I don't think that was what you guys wanted me to test out, but I guess we could try it. Is there another thing here? Oh, I think I'm getting fooled again by the music. It sounds like there's jingling in the music and it's fooling me. <laughs> so there was... There was definitely one over here. I know that. Yeah, right here. There's some hens and hen hens over here. Yeah, there you go. See, we activated that one. <laughs> and then over here, that's one of the oases that we could activate. Once we actually have the fountain. And then here's another one, yeah. But there was there's three of these things that you have to activate. And we activated one, so there's two more somewhere. I'm going to look in the corners. I, I would not be surprised if they just kind of hit them in the corners. I don't know how far. Oh, yeah, there's one up there. Isn't there? Yeah, there's one all the way up there. Man, how do I, I guess I have to go to this ledge? Is there one over here? Like, while I'm here, I, I, I don't, I don't want to come back over here and be like, oh, here's the last one. While I'm over here, I might as well check. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything there. Or over here. Okay. But yeah, we have to. It looks like we have to go from this ramp, and then, and then we can propel ourselves upwards. And that's actually where the uh, the the fountain is. So once we actually activate all the things here, I don't know if there's one of those cactuses is, is, is there that we can activate. Oh, there's a dervish guy up here. We need to watch out for. Yep. Yeah, look at him. All right, let's give. Oh, whoops. Oh, I guess we can give this guy a fashion pot. Look, look, let's look at what he looks like with the bow tie. Oh, you can't really see it too. Oh, there he is. Yeah, you can't really see it too well because a little little spinny ring around him there. <laughs> <laughs> Can't really see that too well, but there's There's two Can I see number three from here though? And like what is the the maximum radius that they could be? Like far away from the fountain uh, Like it should stick out like a sore thumb like those little look like flowers off the top of that guy's head Should see that pretty well and then right here is where the uh, the fountain is so once we actually have the third one activated, this one. Then this should be, uh, flowing water. Whatever that magical ancient water was. Oh, jeez, there's that big tornado down there. Oh, is it over here? Where the Gorda was? I don't think it, I don't think it's over here, though. If it's over here, that'd be kind of weird to be this far away. Well, I think there's actually a, yeah, there's another one of those, uh, oasis plant things over there that we need to worry about. But, or... There's that one there, and then there's another one there. You know, because this one's over here, the other one's over there, it just kind of makes me think there's one, like, over here, you know? Just kind of evenly spread them out and stuff like that, you know? Like, I'm going to go- Oh, whoa, 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 jeez. Like, I'm trying to look around along the corners to see if there's, like, one tangle statue, tangle slime statue that's, like, hidden that you can't really see unless you're, like, at the right angle or something. I am genuine. I am not seeing it. There it is. I knew it. I knew it was over here. I saw it over there. Look at the glowing eyes with the gems. I see it there. Look at that. Ah, man. There we go. We got it. So the fountain should be activated now, right? And I don't know why this guy is so huge. You think we have to put like a giant plort in this guy's mouth, but I guess not. So we need to go back up here. It seems like this is the most reliable way to get back up to that fountain. There might be a better way. I don't know. But now we can activate the fountain. It's going to give us, like, the ancient water or something like that. I, I guess we're going to find out what the actual name of that is here in a sec. Oh, that's the one with the... Okay, over there. We need to see if that's the, uh... The plant that I can give, like, a, a bow tie to. Oh, I can hear the water flowing. You guys hear that? Hold on. Go around the corner. Oh, jeez, I'm almost out of stamina. Whew. All right. Here we go. Ancient water. Yeah, that's what it was called. Okay. So, here's one. Hit this one. Boom. Got no oasis there. Let's go. 22 seconds. 22 seconds. Come on. Here we go. 18 seconds. Another oasis going. Now oh, we're out of stamina, man. Oh, come on. Fashion pod. It didn't work. It didn't work. No. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Come on. I don't think we can do it. I don't think. Ah, man. Five, four, three, two. Oh, it worked. Oh, my gosh. I got three of them right there. Whoa. That was crazy. That was like actually the last second there, you guys. Oh my gosh, look at all the slimes. Oh, you know what's a bad thing though? Now that we have the oasis over here, it's going to be so Oh my gosh, the Gordos or the Largo. <laughs> I'm always messing that up. Now it's going to be even harder for us 
to see the gilded gingers when they spawn in and hear them because now we're going to have oh jeez there's already a tar what in the world how in the world is it well i guess yeah dervish pink and rock slimes over here and phosphor yeah i guess i'm not too surprised there's a heckin tar immediately <laughs> jeez but uh oh 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 there's a gilded oh there's a gold one should i or should i save it i don't know i don't think i, I don't think i know no oh wait whoa wait what i didn't feel give, give me the gilded no don't eat it don't eat that i don't think he can can he oh yeah we got all five of them right there wait hold on wait what six wait how did we what hold on what what just happened right did he eat like a wild gilded ginger like because there was one that this this is where we found the very first one was there one like right here he just came down here ate it and then poofed away but we have six when he eats the gilded ginger oh wait i think yeah okay i think i know what happens he gives you three when he eats anything he must have eaten two carrots or plorts or whatever else but he ate that so fast I'm not complaining though because we've got six gold plorts right there and I still get to keep my gilded ginger <laughs> don't mind if I do I need to put this up in savings to make sure we could uh we could sell it at the most opportune time you know but for right now I guess we'll head back over to I don't know I guess back home at least for right now I put this thing up in storage just a uh, gilded ginger I don't know what to do with the other uh, gold plort though I need to go put that up in like a very specific area because I do not want it to get like sold because I have, I have drones with silos specifically saying okay sell from the silos right so Hmm. I don't know. Oh, you know what? I guess if anything, I could go to like Ogden Ortiz's area. I could do another mission already. Ooh, I can go to Ogden Ortiz's area or speaking of such <laughs> or uh, Mochi Miles's area. And uh, we could put a silo over there, I suppose. Right. So uh, Thor West, Ogden Ortiz. Let's do Thor West. Are we going to get like her last mission anytime soon? Don't suppose you could also get a or don't suppose you also got a cup of sugar kicking around too. <laughs> no, not right now. Two fire slimes and four tangle slimes there, man. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. These guys happy? These guys, any of them escaping? Anything happening? Anything bad? No. I think we're good. Okay, that's good. All right, let's put up the tangle ports over here. Gotta get uh, suctioned up. Boom. Noise. And the gilded ginger I can put over here because, oh, I think these guys are out of water. Yes, yeah, so now with their blue color, they're like frozen violet or whatever it's called. Now with their new color, it's really hard to see when they need water because a little water droplet symbol is blue, but their whole body is also blue, so it doesn't really stick out like the old one, you know? But either way, we have the uh, the spicy tofu there. Now we have the gilded ginger. And I guess we'll go over to like Ogden Ortiz's area just because it's like really good. It's like right here. Well, I guess Mo Mochi Miles is like as far away as this one, but whatever. Let's go over here and uh, let's place it down like right here. Place it down like a silo. We could use it for like just random offsite storage. There you go. At least for right now. And I'll uh, put my gold plorts over here. There you go. I trust Ogden Ortiz will not sell any of my gold plorts. And speaking of such, how, how much are those going for right now? Like, hopefully some pretty good money, right? Let's go see. I need. I should probably grab those lemons here in just a sec, but whatever. I, I need to go check. Oh, wait. Did the market just reset? Oh, I guess it didn't load in or something like that. Uh, yeah, 333. Yeah, I'm not selling this just yet. <laughs> that is way too cheap. Not selling it for anything under 500, maybe even 600. Like we saw it was like 603 last time I sold and then it went up to like 611 immediately after <laughs> or something like that. Just a rub salt in the wound <laughs> and be like, hey, you're missing out on a little bit of money right there, especially because we sold like what, 40 of them or something like that at that time. So yeah, we missed out on a lot of money there, you guys, golly. Oh my gosh, all the pink slimes over here are really hungry. Man, we need to get them a bunch of food. Hold on. We can give them some of the some of that stuff that whatever it's called that started with the letter P. I forgot what it was called. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll just grab a bunch of uh, stuff over here and feed them with this. This is basically what it's for. Just like extra Q berries, extra poker fruit. We just give it to the pink slimes and this is fine. This is more than enough. But now we need to go for Thor West's mission. We need to go to the glass desert, back to the glass desert, try and find two fire slimes and then Hopefully, my, or was it, it might have been four. I guess we'll check before we leave again. But while we're there, I kind of want to get even more because as I think I mentioned last episode, it seems like we're missing fire slimes. Like, I, I, I did get some comments of guys theorizing, like, what happened to our fire slimes. I guess what happens every now and then is that the drone, whenever he goes into the, whatever this is called here, the incinerator area, to pick up the plorts, sometimes he can push out. Wait, why is the, uh, why is Ash, like, not going up right? Oh, I'm putting water in there. Whoops. 
But uh, every now and then he'll go in here to pick up the plorts, but I guess he'll push out a fire slime. And then, but like fire slimes are supposed to walk back into here though, you know? We've seen that before. Is this guy, oh yep, he'd, oh pfft. When I need water, I, I still have the cubeberry selected. When I need cubeberry selected, I have water selected. <laughs> but yeah, I, apparently you can like push them out or something like that, so I don't know what happened to him. Like, did they get pushed out so far that they couldn't reach back inside there and it just died or something like that? I don't know. But either way, yeah, we got a lot of food right now for the uh, for the pink slime. So let's get them a little bit of food and let them, let them get their tummies nice and full with a bunch of pogo fruit and cubeberries and whatever else over here. And I'll probably give them some carrots as well. I know some of the carrots over there with the uh, the odd onions. I know some of those carrots are just sitting there not being used, so I guess we can use those if I need to, right? But uh, well, uh, let, me, let me continue feeding all these pink slimes over here. And you know what? Because we have so many more clip-on fashion pods, let's just throw them in here. Get a bunch of the pink signs with the uh, the red bow tie. Even though they're pink and the red won't really stand out too much on the pink, at least we'll get them a little bit of decoration. You see some of them with some crowns, some of them with some googly eyes, some of them with some bow ties now. So that's, look at that guy, he looks so spiffy. <laughs> I love it, and that guy looks so wacky with his googly eyes, and these guys look so royal with their crowns there too. I love it. I wonder what other uh, fashion pods that you guys can get, because I know some of you guys were actually commenting like two or three episodes ago saying, hey, you can actually find a lot of fashion pods in like this specific area. I think it's like near some cliffs or something like that. So I need to go back in that episode and write down where that was. Maybe we'll find a bunch of fashion pods. We'll just have a little bit of fun just playing dress up with some heckin' slimes or something crazy. So that'd be pretty fun. We need to head back to the glass desert for Thora West's mission. I don't know how much time we have left for her mission because I've been memeing around here for a little while. <laughs> but she wants uh some tangle slime or yeah, tangle slimes and Fire so oh only two oh man nine minutes left four tangle two fire we need to we need to wait until we actually have an event going on here though I cannot find <gasps> gold again hold on hold on oh 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 he's gone already what two of them in like the span of twenty minutes but he's immediately just disappeared there I didn't have anything to feed him man ah you know what there was an area of here where a guild of ginger was ah, I'm not seeing it right now though. Golly. That's a chicken over there. Man. I, he's just straight up gone. Oh, I thought that was a heckin' gilded, uh, gold slime over there, but no. Whoa, what's happening with this guy? So this is not where we're going to find tangled ones, right? I think we need to find tangled ones in a completely different part of the map. Actually, now that I think about it, where was that? I think we need to go this way, right? We want to find tangle. And of course, we need to wait until there's like an, a fire event until we actually get the fire uh, slimes, so don't really have much choice in that. We just have to kind of play the waiting game for that. Let's try and find the tangle ones, though. Oh. Oh, I thought we had another gold one there, but no. What is that noise? Is that another gilded... ginger sound? What is that? I'm not... You guys are hearing that jingling, too, right? Pretty sure we found a gilded ginger. Oh, oh, speak of the tangle, speak of the tangle. Boom. One. We need four. There's another one over here. Boom. Two. Oh, they, oh, there you go. There you go. Oh, there's. Oh, awesome. We have all of them. If I can get these in time before the turn of the Largos. There you go. Okay, we have four. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, there's an extra one right there. Okay, we just need the fire ones now. We just need the fire event. Pretty sure I was hearing some like jingling just a second ago. Yeah, I'm still hearing it. Where's that coming from? Is that a... That's not a gold slime. That's not gilded ginger, is it? I don't think that's the sound for it, though. That must be something else. I don't know. Either way, yeah, we're just kind of killing time here trying to wait for a fire event to happen. And yeah, I don't think we have enough episode... Or time left in this episode for us to, uh... Go to that end part, unfortunately. I guess we memed around a little bit too much earlier on. Oh, I'm hearing that sound again. That must not... Yeah, you guys hear that jingling right there? That must be the sound of, like... Wind knocking against this like crystallized fire or whatever right there. Is that what the lore was? It was like fire frozen in time or something like that. I think we read that once, right? I don't know, but I, you know what? I might just pause real quick actually. Wait until like a fire event kicks in. Then of course we could pick up a bunch of fire slimes. We only need like what one or two of them? I think two of them uh, for Thor. What? Oh well, yeah, we we had nine minutes left earlier. I don't know how much time we have left now. Probably six or well, probably five. All right, think about it. I don't know how much time until another fire event happens, but if I don't if I don't have a fire event happen in the next like pff, couple minutes, I might have to go home and use some of the some of the slime fire slimes back at our uh, incinerator, and I guess just refill that up a little bit later, right? Man, uh, whatever. 
Anyways, like I said, uh, I'll wait until like a fire event hopefully happens and I'll see you guys here in just a sec. Oh, oh, another, another gold. Oh, no, no, don't splash him with, man. That's the third gold we've seen in one episode. How in the world? We got so lucky on that first one, but the second and third were terrible luck. Man, I had stony ends and everything. I guess I could have given him anything there. Except for, I guess, other slimes. I guess he wouldn't really eat the other slimes and give us a uh, gold plorts for that, right? But still, we were a little bit more prepared this time around with the Sony hens. I was picking up just, oh, whoops, just a second ago, but whatever. Still no fire event, though. I don't know how often that's supposed to happen. And I don't, I don't want to wait too much longer, else her, her mission will be, it'll, it'll time out. Man, all right. I'll keep waiting for a couple more minutes. I'll see you guys here in just a bit, and if not, then I guess I'll see you guys back home and we can grab a couple fire slimes from our incinerator and just use those. Oh! You guys! I was actually just giving up a second ago because no fire event was happening. But look! Fire event is starting, but now there's oases everywhere that are safe from the fire, right? I guess we have to specifically go to an area that's unprotected. Definitely not over there, definitely over here, but these are feral, I think, right? Yeah, these are feral. Oh, there we go. We need to grab two of them, and I want, I want to grab it. I, I, I'd say five. Five is a good number. But hopefully we can grab them in time for us to head back to home to Thora West. Get, oh, jeez. And give her the fire slimes, give her the, the tango slimes, and make her happy, and hopefully finish off her quest line and stuff. Golly. Oh, I'm getting damaged. Ah! I knew this was a terrible spot. Man! Where are all the fire slimes? I was kind of thinking back there, like, oh. Because we have so many oases this is, like, activated. Perhaps it's impossible for fire slimes to spawn in now, but no. I guess, like I was thinking, oh, maybe, maybe so much of the map is protected. Now now it's... Oh, jeez. Now, 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 now you can't get, like, fire slimes to spawn in, but no, there's still... Oh, there you go, there you go, there you go. One just flew all the way over there. Where is it? There it is, there it is, there it is. There's one. We get one more. Oh man, yeah, there's one here. We didn't get all of them. Ooh, we missed an air, a whole area? Really? Oh jeez, I don't, th I, I, it might be the whole area over here. I doubt it's just one singular uh, plant right there that we didn't water, right? Hold on, the event, yep, the event just ended. We have full stamina now, okay. Any more fire slimes though? We got one. I, I don't think so. I, we got only one fire slime right there. So I don't know if there, there might be some over there. I don't know. Check over here though. Yeah, I'm not, oh, 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 there you go. We got, okay, let's go, 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 go. We don't have any extra fu- <gasps> Lucky! Lucky! Oh! Oh! Oh, give me money! Give me money! Feed him- feed him- feed him more, uh, chickens! Feed him more! Oh! Eat more chickens! No! No, the- Ah! I almost suctioned him up! Oh! Oh, that would have been so MLG if I could suction him up. And I was trying to put the chicken inside of him while he was, like, floating in front of me, but no. Ah, that didn't work. Alright, whatever, whatever. Hurry, 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 hurry. Cut through. Cut through! No, we ran out of time! Man! Ah, oh, she's probably really upset with me now. Golly! Alright, well, we spent too much time there. Waiting, trying to find fire slimes, whatever else. I guess we could still use these guys. Put them over here with the uh, incinerator, because, yeah, the number has gone down substantially over time. Oh, can you put... Oh, I was... <laughs> you know, I was, I was thinking, like, could I put slimes in there? But no, it's a chicken cloner, not a... Just a cloner in general. I doubt you could put heckin' slimes in there. I, anything other than a chicken, right? So there you go. There's another one right there. There's another one. Okay. So that number's going up, which is good. There we go. Water these guys. I doubt it works with, like, fruit and stuff like that, but I guess I'll do it just because why not? <laughs> and maybe I'll grab a couple chickens so we can end off the episode with me just doing, <laughs> like, gambling with chickens and seeing how many chickens can we get. But I'm pretty... This does not work with this, right? Okay. Myth busted. Seems like it only works with chickens. Ha! No gambling with heckin' pogo fruit and whatever else we have thousands of. Oh! Oh, he's picking up chickens over there, so we got... Ah, uh, there you go. I grabbed this one. And you know what? I'm turning this one into two of them. Oh, 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 whoa! I guess I turned that one into... F oh, man, even more! I just turned one chicken into, like, ten chickens right there. More of them! Holy! Watch, you're gonna spawn in right here, too. 
Oh, right when I say that, they don't spawn in. Come on. <laughs> Here you go, grab this chair. We have 15, 16 chickens that we just casually just picked up right there. Can we turn these 16 chickens into 30 chickens? Into 20 chickens? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. That might be 18A, the number one up. And one up by two right there. Oh my gosh. I think we lost a lot of them. This doesn't look like that many. Uh oh. Oh jeez, it went from 18 to 12. <laughs> that was bad. That was really bad. Uh, that might be like 14 or something. No, that's 10. Oh jeez, we're losing chickens. Oh, what in the world? What happened there? I don't know. Here you go. Keep gambling them by throwing. Oh! What happened there? I don't know. Nine? Oh, more, more chickens. Oh, I think the number went up. We're up to 11 now. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Usually it goes up by like twos instead of like odd numbers. Okay, how many? We had. Oh, that's terrible. 11 chickens down to four. Okay. Uh. I should stop gambling with chick. Down to two? Oh my gosh. We had 16 up to 18 down to two. And these guys are starving. Oh, man. Okay, I need to stop right now before I uh, get like a gambling addiction or something like that. That's not, that, that, that's not good. <laughs> Let's just go back. Let's get let end off the episode right here. Uh oh Okay, I thought this guy was unhappy or whatever. I thought that was oh there is an unhappy one in there. Hold on. Hold on Just so these guys do not cause havoc or anything get these guys nice and fed boom We had so many phase lemons in there earlier I guess they might have despawned or something like that and they just didn't eat them anymore There you go and this angle. Just trying to reach all of them because they are so heckin' huge and bounce all over the place. Like, I can't force feed all of them at once. <laughs> but there you go. Either way, I guess we could end off the, uh, oh, whoops. I'll keep that on that. that that's fine. I don't, like, over time, like, if, if it's up too high, we lose so many phase lemons and they just sit there and rot away. If it's too low, like, they, they don't get fed fast enough or whatever. Like, it's hard to find a balance. Wish we could have a 2.5 instead of... One, two, three, right there. <laughs> but either way, I guess I'll end off the episode right here, like I said, like 10 times. So, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as a new episode of Slime Rancher comes out. Because next episode, I, I know I said I wanted to do it for this episode, but we kind of ran out of time. Uh, where are the? Oh, yeah, over here. I want to go to the end of the glass desert, see what's going on over there, and just. I guess beat the game basically, but even though we beat the game, we still continue playing the game, right? So uh, just for curiosity's sake, I want to see what this end sequence is for Slime Rancher. And then uh, I guess we can meme around with some other stuff. And uh, I'll be sure to read you guys comments from the past like four episodes or something like that. Cause there's a few things that I, I want to do, but I didn't write them down. So I, I need to actually go back and make sure I write that down. But <laughs> either way, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Slime Rancher. Oh, bye there.